Hey everybody, it's Faith from Fireside and Tarot. Hope everybody is doing well. Hmm, two of wands reversed. Somebody's stuck at a crossroads. Hmm. See if it comes out for somebody. All right, this is going to be the cost of baby all signs for December 2021. I apologize for being behind. <sighs> and I do this every month because cusp babies are special. Y'all, some of the most mixed up mofos I've ever had to deal with in my life, but that's okay because you're cool. And uh, I myself sit just outside of the Scorpio Sagittarius cusp. And I have a lot of Scorpio traits that I know have nothing to do with my Venus and Scorpio. So <laughs> anyway, enough about me. It resonates cool. If it doesn't, it's... It doesn't. It's just not your story. And that's okay. We'll try again next month. Really not a moon rising or Venus thing. This is sun sign specific, and I apologize for that. But, you know, if, if you sit through the whole thing and you can take anything out of any one of the readings I'm about to do that, you know, please take it with you because you were meant to see it. So we're going to spend about the next hour, maybe. I, I'm going to try not to go over an hour because I have a ton of stuff I got to do today. I actually have another reading I have to do after this and I got a personal I got to get done today. So what else? If you're a cross watcher up in here, oh my God, you are going the extra mile. Let me tell you. Even knowing that your person's birthday sits on a Zodiac sun cusp and you're willing to come in here and try to figure them out, props to you, friend. If you're new here think we might vibe and stuff, you want to come back and hang out some more, more than welcome to do that. Just hit the subscribe button, the notification bell, so you know when I upload. If you're returning, welcome back. It's good to see you. I am opening comments back up in good faith that people aren't going to be jerks coming up in here. If somebody wants to be a jerk coming up in my comments, I will shut them back off. I got to protect my energy. Okay? I do. So please, don't be a jerk. That's all I ask. I don't like engaging with mean people, and I don't like being a mean person. I don't like doing mean things. I want to shut my comments back off. Where was I? Oh, gosh. I keep losing my place. Where was I? Oh, never make a life-altering decision based on a terror reading. I don't care whose cards they are, mine or somebody else's. And once again, if it's just not your story, just leave the cards on the table and walk away. Okay. Don't forget to hit the like button. Super cool of you if you do. If you don't, that's okay too. I'm not going to twist anybody's arm. But all those little things help the channel, help the messages be circulated to those who might need them. So just keep that in mind, even if it's not for you. All right, I think we're good. Aries, Taurus, you're up, baby. We're going to tip down and get it going. Okay. One quick shuffle. Get them lined up for you. I'm being told one more quick shuffle. Okay. All right. Queen of Pentacles, three cups reversed. You shining, babies. You shining. That's beautiful. Coming into your own. You're beautiful. You're wanted. Don't need nobody. Your challenge is three of cups reverse, though. Maybe dealing with a disconnect. Maybe not feeling so celebratory. Some of us are struggling this time of year, so I get that. What's coming in for you? Oof. Hanged man, the seven of cups reversed, and the eight of wands. Huh. Alright. Okay. Okay. Could be a Pisces. Could be coming to terms with something. I see possibility of some confusion coming in. Possibility of some communication or forward movement in a situation. Eh. 
and it's all happening. High Priestess, Three of Pentacles reversed, Two Upside Down, Three. You could be disconnecting from a third party situation right now, some of you. Not all of you. It's a possibility. If it's not yours, leave it on the table, guys. There was a disconnect here, though. Definitely a disconnect. High Priestess could have been a lack of clarity. It's the outcome coming out of it, not putting energy into it. Okay. Bottom of the deck, Eight of Cups, moving on. Very good. This is acceptance of a situation. This is you using your intuition in a situation. All right. A little bit of clarity, guys. Just a little. Just a little. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Decide to fly out of my deck, did you? Two of Coins into the Three of Coins. All right. Regaining your balance, rebuilding foundations. I'm going to throw this right here. Just kind of set that off to the side. It says something. It means something. I just didn't ask it to go somewhere. So we're just going to leave it there. Give me one on this hanged man for what's coming in. Give me one on this hanged man. Ten of swords reversed. Into the ace of swords reversed. Coming to a point of acceptance. Something you've been fighting and ending you've been fighting in the beginning that you've been fighting. You're accepting the situation. All right. All right. Seven of Cups reversed. Talk to me. Talk to me about the Seven of Cups reversed. Nine of Wands reversed. Ten of Wands reversed. One more. I'm not going to dig too deep, guys. I'm going to try to do these as fast as I can. High Priestess reversed. Empress reversed. Wounded egos, something didn't grow. Aries, Taurus, why you guys gotta make me dig? Why you guys gotta make me dig? Confusion. Page of coins, knight of coins, okay. Mm. Could be an apology or an offer coming in, something that wasn't growing, something's gonna cause confusion. Walls tumbling down, throwing in the towel, burdensome ending, avoiding a burdensome ending. Wounded egos, something not growing. If this is resonating with anybody, just let me know, because this is just a cluster cuss right now. You got something coming in. Could be an apology. I think it's something you already threw the towel in on, though. That's why it's going to like cause confusion. <clears throat> Talk to me about this Eight of Wands. What's up with this Eight of Wands? It feels sudden. It feels sudden. Could be distance. Hierophant reversed. Lovers reversed. Sun reversed, judgment reversed. Oh my God, I feel like this is coming out of nowhere. Judgment upright, world upright, ah, oh, got it. Putting distance between you, you're gonna put distance in there. It's forward movement. It's forward movement. These are eights. I'm hearing, feeling, sensing, running like hell. 
making the final judgment call. Somebody trying to resurrect something, you're going to end it. You're going to get closure. Acceptance. All right, talk to me about this high priestess down here. One on the high priestess down here. Just one. Just one. Just one. Whoa. I didn't ask for 20. I'm going to take the one on top and put the rest back. Four of Wands reversed into the Five of Wands reversed. Something came tumbling down. You avoided conflict. Could be a soulmate connection. Could have been a lack of clarity. Things weren't clear. Energetic drawing. One more. Woo! Hi. Hello. Star reverse. Moon reverse. Clarity. Clarity. Something couldn't heal. Something couldn't heal. Something couldn't heal. There was avoidance of conflict. Maybe something came tumbling down to avoid conflict. Clarity in the secrets, the moon, the moon into the sun. That was a long, dark night, wasn't it? You received clarity about something, even if something had to come tumbling down. There's a disconnect. One on the three of pens. One on the three of pens reversed. Just one, just one, just one. Just one, just one, just one. Just one, just one, just one. Just one. Not going to dig too deep. Nine of cups into the ten of cups. You found your happiness. You found inner peace in this disconnect. I'm not getting into that. We know the rest of that story. You're putting it out of your head. You're moving on. You're moving forward. You're becoming more stable. You're building foundations. You're regaining your balance. You're making peace with it, guys. You're making peace with it. One on this Eight of Pens reversed. It's not going to keep you up at night anymore. Page of Wands reversed. Knight of Wands reversed. No, don't, don't engage with it. This depends on you no longer putting energy into it. You, you no longer feeding it. You no, just accepting it. Not engaging with it. Not moving forward. Not communicating. Five of coins. Oh, gosh. Five of coins and the six of coins at the bottom of the deck. So sometimes you have to shut and lock that door to bring your game balance. Sometimes you just have to. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Truth be told. Number 14. 1 plus 4 is 5. 5 is the number of contrast and change. Number 14. Communication, a sign. A cledon, the ancient name for a spontaneous oracle delivered innocently by the speaker, pointing the way to your highest good. Okay. Truth be told. Spirit sends you signs when you ask for them. When you believe, you will receive them. And when you allow yourself to become fluent in the language of symbols, oracles, and omens, they may come to you as a bird flying by, a logo on a truck, and a song on the radio. Expect confirmation that you're pointed in the right direction. Keep your eyes, keep your ears open, for someone might say just the right thing that will give you the answer to your query. 
Today your message is this. Spirit hears you and the reply is favorable. This is a card of someone not being pointed in the right direction. You will be pointed. You will know what to do. Things will become clear. My Aries Taurus cusp babies. All right. I'm going to pause, clear decks, and go to the next sign. Okay. Taurus Gemini. What do we have for Taurus Gemini? Only Moses, guys. King of Swords, Queen of Cups. That's an odd pair. Ace of Wands reversed. Hmm. Sounds like an honest conversation about feelings and something not getting started. If it's yours, take it. If it's not, leave it alone. Let's see if they come back out. Four of Cups. Somebody might be in contemplation about something. The Magician. Huh. All right. I think we're about there. Could be manifesting something. All right. Could be dealing with an Aries. Air sign. Water sign. Five of Swords, Death Reversed. Mm. Victory at a cost. The challenge, not allowing something to die so something else can be reborn. What's up? Ten of Wands, Five of Cups Reversed, Eight of Swords. Not processing emotions, releasing the burden possibly coming out of a state of sadness or ignoring your sadness, one of the two. Eight of Swords. Why? The Moon. The Four of Wands. Four of Pentacles reversed. Okay. Eleven, eleven connection. Huh. There was a lack of clarity. Lack of clarity. could have had something to do with the full moon could be a Pisces I got Scorpio here too letting go letting go letting go the devil and the ten of Pentacles reversed Anxiety will do that. High Priestess at the bottom of the deck. Hmm. Huh. Could be intuition. Could still be some secrets afoot. All right, talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me. Victory at a cost. Not allowing something to end. Talk to me about death reversed. One on death reversed, please. One on death reversed. Hi. Five of cups reversed into the six of cups reversed. Not processing the emotions. There's bad blood. There's bad blood here. That five of swords usually brings on some bad blood and hurt feelings. Why the ten of wands? Three of Cups into the Four of Cups. Could be Reunion. Could be Contemplation. One more. Ten of Wands into the Ace of Wands. Celebration. The release. The start over. That's beautiful.
Hmm. Okay. So you're starting over. You're starting over with bad blood. I don't know how I feel about that. Tell me more about this Five of Cups reversed. One on the Five of Cups reversed. Yeah, crossroads, two of wands into three of wands. Those are reversed. Walking away. Not processing it. Not processing it leaves you stuck. Not processing it leaves you stuck. Start over all you want. You gotta process the emotions, guys. You have to process the emotions. Why the Eight of Swords? Why the Eight of Swords? Ace of Swords reversed, Two of Swords reversed, King of Swords reversed, Page of Swords reversed. Oh shoot! Anxiety. Anxious. Things aren't kicking off. There's bad blood. There's harsh words. There's silence. Anxiety. Walk out of that cage anytime you want. You can. Some of you may be questioning a past decision. This feels like an event. This feels like an event. You want on this moon. One on the moon. One on the moon. One on the moon. Five of wands reversed into the six of wands reversed. Four of coins reversed into the five of coins reversed. The path was not lit. Well, shit. Oh my gosh. The release, the letting go. The avoidance of conflict. Slipping into the mist. I think some of you may have disappeared. Somebody goes to do avoid conflict or you goes to do avoid conflict. There was no clarity. It's like they literally just slipped into the mist. Dang, all right. Why the four of wands? Why the four of wands? Eight of coins into the nine of coins, knight of coins into the queen of coins. And they just pop back up. All of a sudden, they want to put effort into it. Maybe you saw them at a party or an event. Maybe that's what... 
One more. One more. The Four of Wands is also my Minor Arcana Tower. Two of Cups. Three of Cups. Three of Cups to the Four of Cups. Yeah. That's Reunion. Someone wanted to came back and wanted to put in effort, but I think you were good being single. Somebody brought you an offer, but I think you were good on your own. Somebody wanted to reconnect. One more. One more. Page of Wands reversed, Nine of Wands reversed. Oh my gosh. Caught off in communication. You cut him off at the knees. It didn't go anywhere. Huh? Why the Four of Pentacles? Why the Four of Pentacles? <clears throat> Ten of Swords reversed to the Eight of Swords reversed. You let go and you never processed it. Or you let go and somebody else didn't process it. Double reversed the tower. Four of swords reversed to the five of swords. No process. Restless energy. Tail between their legs. Tail between their legs. Defeat. Somebody, somebody wanted to change their ways. Somebody wanted to rebuild. You, somebody else didn't want to. I don't know who did what here. Place yourself wherever you see fit. If it's yours, take it. If it's not, leave it. The outcome... This trips me up right here. You're drawn together. This, there's, a, there's a pull here. There's a pull. It's a very strong pull. It's one of them soulmates, isn't it? It's one of them soulmates. Love them or hate them, they're still a soulmate. Sorry. Sorry, that's just how that works sometimes. Move one on this devil. Temperance reversed. Devil reversed. Lack of patience, lack of positive energy, things not flowing. This is toxic. And it's going to hang out with you. And it's going to cause you impatience in other relationships and other connections because you're still drawn to it. And it's going to impede you getting where you want to be until you process what you need to process until you let go without bad blood one on the ten of pens nine of cups to the ten of cups until you make peace with this and love yourself again Nothing that you try to do is going to work. You have to make peace with this. Yes, they were a soulmate. They are. And sometimes soulmates come into your life to teach you a valuable lesson. And when it's time to go, it's time to go. I don't know who I'm talking to right now. When it's time to go, it's time to go. Eight of wands and nine of wands. It might be best to move forward. And to wall yourself off to this and disconnect from it. Let's get a wisdom. Let's get a wisdom. Wisdom. 
Unfinished Symphony. Number 10. 10 is the card of endings. And completion. Oh, this just got real and it just got weird. Let's read Unfinished Symphony. Unfinished business and incomplete lesson. Lack of closure. The need to make amends. Whoa. This is a time to tie up loose ends as you near the completion of a cycle or project and mastery of a lesson or skill. Before you can move forward, it's important that you come to terms with where you are now. Practice radical acceptance. Take inventory so that emotional and psychological closure can occur and the answers you seek will be found. You can't move forward if you're leaving things unfinished. Reflect on what has passed so the symphony can finally end on a high note. Holy shit, Taurus Gemini Cuss. Pardon my French, but that ties it together, don't it? All right. We're going to pause, we're going to clear the decks, and move on. Gemini Cancer. All right, Gemini Cancer. Moving right along, moving right along. I always try to do this quick, but I never seem to be that quick at it. The Empress and the Seven of Pentacles reversed. Something is growing. Something is evolving. Something has potential. The challenge is a lack of patience. Okay. Could be a pregnancy involved. If it's not yours, leave it alone. Okay. Bottom of the deck, two of pentacles reversed. What do we have? Queen of Wands reversed, four of swords reversed, five of cups reversed. Oh shit. Jaded bitchery. Restlessness. Unprocessed emotions. Why? Self isolation. Honest communication and a lack of self worth. Conclusion, letting something go, and the possibility of a resurrection. Gemini Cancer, what the F? Just throwing that out there. All right. King of Cups reversed at the bottom of the deck. King of Cups reversed into the page of Cups reversed. Lack of emotion, lack of expression of emotion. We'll see if it comes back out anywhere. Might mean something, might not. Things are out of balance, I know that. Oh, who came out? Ten of Wands into the Ace of Wands. Okay, so you're releasing a burden, letting something go, trying to strike a new match. All right. Why the Queen of Wands reversed? She's a little jaded. She doesn't like it when she doesn't get what she wants. Eight of Swords reversed and then the Nine of Swords reversed. It's like a switch, isn't it? Not giving it a second thought. Oh, hi. Three of Wands into the Four of Wands. Next ship, please. Maybe the next ship will be the one that's mine. Me one on the four of swords reversed. Temperance reversed, the devil reversed. Impatience. Possibly disconnecting from some toxic situations, but you're restless. 
That's negative energy. Restlessness. Knight of Wands into the Queen of Wands upright. Moving forward anyway, because doggone it, you're going to get what you want. You understand you have to process the emotions that went along with whatever you're jaded about, right? It's all about processing emotions. Why the, why the Five of Cups reversed? You keep trucking along with those negative energy monkeys on your back, you're not going to get very far. Just throwing that out there. Six wands reversed, seven wands reversed. Defeat. Not being seen. Could be a return that doesn't go very well. Or a lack of a return. One more. Give me one more. Judgment in the world. One on judgment. One on judgment. I'm feeling incomplete return or a return, a return that doesn't go as planned and something coming to an end. That's what I'm feeling. Maybe the next ship might be my ship, but if I wait long enough for the ship that I want, it'll come. I'm just going to chase after the ship. Eight of Wands reversed and the Nine of Wands reversed. Lack of communication, throwing in the towel. This is closure. This is closure. Some of y'all have been waiting for closure on something. It's happening. Whether you bring it onto yourself or it gets handed to you, you get it. Now, closure can mean something closes out altogether, or something closes out and starts over, meaning you put all the bad shit behind you. Return not going as planned. Return not going as planned. This was isolation. Give me the one on the hermit reversed. That's just going total hermit, not talking to anybody and not dealing with anything. Ignoring it. Having the path before you but not wanting to walk it. Is there a shortcut? The Empress into the Emperor. Somebody may have tried to avoid growth or something growing or something that had potential. Three of Cups into the Four of Cups. Reunion. Somebody avoided a reunion. Dang. Somebody got impatient. Maybe you needed to walk a path before a reunion could begin and somebody got impatient. Gemini Cancer Cups, now, mind you, mind you, put yourself wherever you see fit. I'm just throwing stuff out. Talk to me about this Knight of Swords. One on the Knight of Swords. One on the Knight of Swords. King of Swords, Queen of Swords, <laughs> sorry, King of Swords, Page of Swords. That's a conversation. It's like wisdom shit. That's honest communication. One more.
You know, sometimes when you speak truth, you got to cut somebody's heart out. Six of coins into the seven of coins. Balance. Someone had to have a conversation to restore balance. Four of coins, five of coins, two of wands reversed, three of wands reversed. Wow. Somebody withheld. Somebody withheld. Somebody drew back. Somebody got left out in the cold. Sometimes you got to cut somebody's heart out. Sometimes you have to do what's best for you. Somebody got stuck at the crossroads. Somebody didn't want to wait anymore. Somebody got impatient. Paths were taken. Paths were taken. Somebody got jaded. There was restless energy. And a return is not going to go so well. Things are still out of balance. Give me one on this King of Pentacles reversed. Give me one on this King of Pentacles reversed. Perfect reversed, lovers reversed. Missed opportunity, somebody didn't get picked. Somebody was left with very low self-worth. Somebody got their guts ripped out. Oh my gosh. Ace of swords reversed, two of swords reversed, eight of cups reversed, nine of cups reversed. I will be back. I'm hearing I will be back. I'm not letting this go. I will be back. One of this four of pentacles reversed. Gem cancer costs. You gotta like release a burden and start your life. You gotta let somebody go. You gotta let somebody go. Ace of Cups, Two of Cups. If you choose not to let somebody go and you choose to start over and reunite, that's on you. Can you let this go? I feel like things are still kind of out of balance. I feel like somebody might still be juggling. Full Reverse, Magician Reverse, somebody! Might be pulling, trying to pull some emotional strings. I don't know if you can trust this 100%. Some, there's like fuckery going on here. Serious emotional fuckery. I feel like this person has been in and out of your life. I feel like you tried to be honest. Shit. Maybe you're dealing with like some jaded bitchery this in this month, or this next coming month. Five of cups reversed and the six of cups reversed. There's bad blood here. Do you want to start? You want to restart something on a bad note? I don't know. It's kind of wisdom. Wow, this was messed up. Severely messed up. I think this is speaking of self-growth. Yin. Yin. That's two. Two is choices. This is a time of calculated receptivity as you gracefully await what is coming to you, ready to accept it when it does. Yin does not involve frozen dreams or even resting, but rather consciously allowing things to flow to you, poised to receive the bounty that will be made available to you. It implies sensitivity 
as you alertly study the actions of others and contemplate how they will affect you and yours. Remember, you must make space for miracles to appear. Be the shaped, not the shaper. And you'll see how quickly your dreams manifest. Somebody needed that. Somebody needed that. Hmm. All right. Hmm. All right. We're going to pause. Clear the decks and go on to the next sign. All right. Cancer Leo. We got for Cancer Leo. We got for Cancer Leo. King of Cups reversed, Knight of Cups reversed. long night end. There's a return and contemplation. Water, 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 water. Swing and a miss. Six of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Lack of emotion. Or overly emotional. Challenge, silence, watching from afar, not giving or receiving a cup, not being willing to. What the F? Okay. I, I, there's a return and a contemplation coming up. Shit rolling out of control, closing of a gap or something stopping altogether. I feel like this is all happening because... Either a missed opportunity or somebody had to go back to a family situation. Dang. All right. Hold up. 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 Okay. Hold up. Hold up. What are you? The lovers into the chariot. There was a choice here. We're going to put that up there. There was a choice. <laughs> All right. Okay. Could have been a Gemini you were dealing with. Talk to me, talk to me. What's this Knight of Cups reversed? One of the Knight of Cups reversed. Four Wands. Celebration. Could be a soulmate twin flame connection. <sighs> conflict. It's leading into conflict. For, this is what I love about the in-between tarot. It's two cards in one. <sighs> Maybe you don't know how to approach someone. You feel the connection, but you don't know how to approach them because you're afraid of it's going to be conflict. Trying to shut your emotions off. 
Why is the Ten of Swords reversed here? Give me one of those Ten of Swords reversed. Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me about this Ten of Swords reversed. Nine of Cups reversed to the Ten of Cups reversed. You're only holding yourself back from your own happiness at this point. Not allowing something painful to come to an end. Not wanting anything to do with anybody's cup. Ace of Cups, Two of Cups. There's potential there. You want to get something new started, but how many times do I have to say it until you complete something else? Something new cannot begin. Possibly you meet someone that might get started. That's where the choice comes in. Six of Wands. Talk to me about the Six of Wands. Remember, this is good for 30 days, so. King of Wands into the Page of Wands. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's why they're coming back. Could be a sexual connection. It's a return nonetheless. Might be a full force comeback. Might be just something as simple as, I don't know, random text messages and dirty pictures. I don't know. Take it over, resonates. Six of coins the seven of coins so they're coming back to level playing field they might be this might be a full force comeback eight of swords reverse nine of swords reverse maybe they're getting over the anxiety and crap maybe it's going to get you over a state of anxiety or it's going to put you into like full full fledged mental prison mode Strength reversed, term it reversed. Could be. Could be. Somebody's inability to hold back is going to make you like self isolate. Four of Cups. Deep contemplation. Give me one on this Four of Cups. One on this Four of Cups. Ace of Swords reversed. King of Swords. Page of Swords. Two of Swords reversed. Is it just words? He's a wands upright, two of wands upright. You have to make a decision, but you have to make a decision with a little bit more clarity. I don't think you have enough clarity to make a decision. I think the conversation is going to take place. like somebody's trying to hand you a cup somebody comes back and you got to choose do you want a new start with something old or do you want a new start but if you want a new start you got to close out to something old you have a choice to make which one's equal I feel like whatever's coming back. Mm. One on the hair if it reversed. One on the hair if it reversed. Thank you. Seven of cups to the eight of cups. Had options. Had to move on. King of coins to the page of coins. That's 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 the that's the father husband card. That's the father husband card. 
father, husband, mother, wife, you know, take it however resonates, insert whatever sex and pronoun works best for you. Whoever, whatever you were dealing with had to go back to a family situation. I'm leaving it at that. So they had an option. And just as you're getting ready to move on, you have a choice to make. Dang. All right. One of the Emperor reversed. What's the Emperor reversed all about? What's the Emperor reversed all about? Thank you. What? Two of Swords reversed to the Three of Swords reversed. Ten of Wands reversed to the Eight of Wands. Ace of Wands reversed. Oh my gosh. Vulnerability. Lack of control. Humble. Humbleness. I made the wrong decision. Let me unbreak your heart. It's not over. Can we start over? Can we start over? Someone's going to be humbling themselves to you. So, are you closing the gap? Are you stopping the chariot altogether? What are you doing? You went on this chariot reversed. You got a choice to make. You have got a choice to make. You have got a choice to make. Knight of Wands to the Queen of Wands. Hmm. What do they want? What do you want? You have to decide what you want and go forward with it. One more on that. Justice into the hanged man. Well, karma to play itself out. Three of coins reversed, four of coins reversed. Do you let go or do you hang on? Boo, wisdom. We need a wisdom. We need a wisdom. We need a wisdom. Regeneration. Four plus six is ten. Ten is endings and new beginnings. Regeneration. Talk to me about regeneration. Rebirth, second chances, new opportunities. Second chances are available to you now. Whatever opportunities you thought were dead are now revived in a more authentic, stronger form. Whatever you may have perceived as a failure or loss is now being replaced by something better and more powerful growing in its place. This rebirth is assured. Step into your new life. Destiny is being fulfilled in wondrous ways. It's card of destiny. Justice is a card of destiny. It's, it's a card of karma playing out and the universe doing what needs to be done. Cutting out what needs to be cut out. Balancing what needs to be balanced. So, y'all, take it if it's yours. Leave it if it ain't. I'm hitting pause and clearing the decks for the next sign. All right, Leo Virgo, we're keeping it rolling. Keeping it rolling. Keeping it rolling. Seven of Cups. Reversed. Could be some confusion afoot. 
Nine of Swords reversed at the bottom of the deck. Might be full-blown anxiety attacks. Might be not giving a shit. I don't know. It can mean the same thing. Let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Let's see what comes back out. Six Cups reversed in the star. There's bad blood here, and the challenge is healing. Could be an Aquarius or a water sign you're dealing with. Five of Swords. Empress. Queen of Swords reversed. Hmm. All right. Crossroads, lack of foundation, disconnection. Somebody made a choice. Okay. It's pretty cut and dry. Outcome. Make or break. Anxiety. And a wand reversed. Deciding to disengage, not move forward. And Bottom of the deck, four of pentacles, letting go. All right. This seems super cut and dry. All right, talk to me. Five of swords. This, this feels like battle of the wits. Talk to me about this five of swords. Standing up doing what's best for you. Four of Wands reversed into the Five of Wands. Just letting it tumble down and avoiding conflict. Okay. All right. So you're going to let it tumble. Towers fall for a reason. And the Four of Wands reversed is my little minor arcana tower. Oof. One of the Empress. Thank you. Hanged Man reversed. Death reversed. There's still potential here. You don't want to let it go. Maybe they don't want to let it go. Could be an opportunity for personal growth. Give me one more. Okay, I'll take two. Will reverse. Justice reversed. Seven of coins. Eight of coins. If I just invest a little bit more time, it doesn't have to be over. There's potential for growth here. But this is unbalanced as fuck. Death reversed comes when something needs to end and it's not. You're fighting an ending. So are you letting it tumble down and then reconsidering? What are we doing here? One on this Queen of Swords. One on this Queen of Swords. Maybe they're going to fight the ending and try to talk you out of it. Maybe we're going to try to talk you out of walking away. Six, five of wands reversed, six of wands reversed. You're cutting it off and avoiding conflict. You are not allowing this to come back. Really? Really? One second. Good lord. Don't know what that was all about. Don't really care. Okay, where are we at? Yeah, I see you just disengaging and not allowing this to happen. I f I'm not even going to clarify this. I feel like you just, you made your choice. You made a decision. Possibly due to some bad blood. And I, I don't know if I want to delve into that. Yeah, I do. Give me one on these three. Just one to explain these three. I, I have a feel for it. Knight of Wands. Oh. Not a wands reverse, not a wands upright. Sun reversed, judgment reversed. This is somebody that has been in and out of your life repeatedly, I feel like. It has never led to happiness. It is constantly being, you know, killed and then resurrected again. That's how I feel. I feel like you're letting it go. 
The Eight of Swords is your outcome, though. Why? Why the Eight of Swords? The moon into the sun. Really? Okay, now I see you second guessing yourself. Should I have waited out long enough? Could it have made me happy if I waited out long enough? I don't know. Could it have? You need to heal from this. If there's a constant flow of bad blood here and hurt feelings and someone's in and out of your life, you need to decide what's going to make you happy. That's how I feel about that. One on the Knight of Wands reversed. Queen of Cups, King of Cups, Three of Coins, Four of Coins. <laughs> you need to disengage from this. They give the cup, they take it away. They give the cup, it's only half full. They build the foundation, then they lock you out. Feels like possessive weirdness to me. And there's the Seven of Swords into the Eight of Swords and Judgment Reversed into the World Reversed. They keep coming back, telling you the same old sob story, getting your anxiety up. Keep trying to drudge this out because they don't want it to end. This is manipulation, y'all. This is manipulation. Seven of Cups into the Eight of Cups because they're just going to cause confusion. They're going to bounce again. You need to decide what you want. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Loyal heart. Three plus 35. Three plus five is eight. It is the card of forward movement. Number 35. Loyal heart. If I can find the page. Fidelity, loyalty, and devotion. Evidence of loyalty will appear in your life. Others will prove they're faithful to you, and you will in turn commit fully to them. There's a sure and abiding serenity in your heart. Know that spirit is always loyal to you. No matter the outer circumstances in your life, trust and have faith that you are eternally loved, always divinely protected, and divinely directed. If spirit is trying to direct you away from something, take it out, it resonates. I'm going to squash that. All right. We're going to pause, clear the decks, and go on to the next sign. All right, Virgo Libra. What do we have for Virgo Libra? My Virgo Libra cuss babies. Let's give it a good shuffle. Patiently waiting for your investment. Seven of Pentacles. Strength reversed is the challenge. An inability to hold back. Okay, I think I'm dragging. Page of Wands reversed to the Tower and Death. Well, it happens, doesn't it? Why? Four of Swords, Queen of Wands, Ten of Cups reversed.
Nine of Swords, King of Swords reversed. Nine of Pentacles reversed at the bottom of the deck. Codependency. Something's gonna come tumbling down. Something is gonna come to an end so something new can begin. I think this is all about your reaction to it and it's all happening because whether or not you want to admit it, I don't think you were happy. Patiently waiting, not really being able to hold back. Talk to me about strength reversed. What are you not holding back from? Queen of Rocks first. <gasps> Somebody's not getting what they want, and it's getting really hard to hold back. It's like some fiery emotional shit. Maybe you're dealing with a fire sign. It is a card of Leo. They are both upside down Leo cards. You might be dealing with a Leo. You might not be. I don't know. I also got two Scorpio cards here, side by side. Yeah, just different, just about everybody. All right, talk to me about the Naval Wands. What's the Page of Wands reversed about? Talk to me about the Page of Wands reversed. Page of Wands reversed. Star reversed, Moon reversed, lack of communication, things becoming clear, lack of healing, lack of positivity, Lack of hope, losing hope. The wheel in justice. Okay. Yeah, universe is bringing in a tower and a death cycle. Universe is bringing something to an end. Destiny is about to play out whether or not you like it. One on the tower. One on the tower. Chair reverse, strength reverse. Something's going to come to a dead stop. Possibly because someone's no longer able to hold back. One more. Ace of Wands reverse, Two of Wands reverse, Strength in the upright, The Hermit in the upright. What do you do? Which way do you go? This is going to send you down a path. You can't escape the tower. The tower spares no one. Something's going to come to a dead stop, and you're going to have to decide where you go from there. But either way, something is coming to an end, so something else can start. It's something you refuse to put to an end. King of Wands, Page of Wands. Hierophant reversed, Lovers reversed. You move forward. You're not going to be given an option. One on the Four of Swords.
two of swords reverse to the three of swords reverse. There was a disconnect, there was a choice, there was heartbreak. You tried to avoid heartbreak, you tried to just keep going. You tried to just keep going. One on the Queen of Swords, one on the Queen of Wands, one on the Queen of Wands. One on the Queen of Wands. Who is the Queen of Wands? Ten of Wands to the Ace of Wands. That's why you hung out. King of Swords reversed to the Page of Swords reversed. Is that really a reason to hang on if you're not happy? Is that a reason to hang on? <sighs> could have been an emotional connection. It could have been a sex-based connection. It, this is codependent as fuck. You hung on in a situation where you were not happy. And you continued to hang on. Like, you waited patiently for it to fall apart. Oh, it'll fall apart on its own. Somebody here was codependent. It's like, give me one reason to leave. Mm. And I will go. Mm. That's how this feels. World reversed, full reversed. You weren't happy. You didn't trust this person. But at the same time, you didn't want it to end for whatever reason. You didn't want it to end. You fought the ending. Seven of Swords reversed to the Eight of Swords reversed, the Moon to the Sun. Receiving clarity. Like you knew what was going on, but you didn't do anything about it. You just waited for sunshine. All right. You're going to be anxious as fuck for a minute. Let me throw one on this Nine of Swords. Throw one on this Nine of Swords. I'm getting about spent. I might have to divide this into two videos. Shit. I might have to, guys. I apologize. I might have to because I'm, I'm about spent here. Knight of Swords, Queen of Swords. Yeah. That honest communication. Can't avoid this conversation. It's got to happen. Can you cups reverse to the pit? It's, it's your emotional reaction. Ace of Cups reversed, Two of Cups reversed, Ace of Swords upright, Two of Swords upright. It's making the decision with clarity. Having the clarity you need and using it to make the right choice. Twos are about choices. Aces are about new beginnings. You have to do this from a non-emotional point of view. How much are you willing to put up with? How much anxiety are you going to let this cause? One on this King of Swords reversed for the make or break.
Lovers reversed, chariot reversed. Making the choice to disconnect and stop the chariot. What the F? Queen of Swords to the King of Swords. Making the logical choice. Not being emotional about it. Ending the codependency cycle. What the? What? Okay, I need a wisdom. I need a wisdom. Virgo, Libra, what is going on? Something's going to go down, and it should have gone down a while ago. I feel like this is postponed for way too long. The only thing you can control is how you react. A leg up. For 34. 3 plus 4 is 7. 7 is options. Number 34. Receiving help, delegating authority, independent, interdependence. Okay. You've come to a point where going it alone is no longer optimal for you. Life is a way of presenting you with perfect people to align with who can give you a leg up during this next phase in your journey. Help comes to you in all areas of your life where you need a boost. The trick is to accept that aid so freely given when you embrace interdependence, allowing teamwork and independence to commingle. Miracles happen. Now is such a time. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. All right. We're going to clear the deck. And I think I got one more sign in me, and I think I'm going to have to split this into two videos, guys. I'm sorry. I'm about spent for the day. It's feeling good when I started. All right. All right, Libra Scorpio. I'm just going to go for as long as I can go. <laughs> trying to finish all the signs. I'm going to try like hell, but I'm getting tired. I thought I had more in me. All right. All right. One quick shuffle. Let's get it done. Conflict, lack of trust. Who are you fighting with? Who are you fighting with? Ten of Pentacles reversed. Seven of Swords reversed. Ace of Wands. Ace of Cups. Temperance. Judgment reversed. Oh boy. reversed hmm all right guys oh hey the full upright and the magician you're on a new path manifesting new shit I don't think somebody's very happy about that. I think it's causing conflict. Alright, this full reverse can be you not trusting someone 
or someone not trusting your ability to make a situation. Ten of Wands, Ace of Wands, releasing the burden. Somebody doesn't want to be released. Somebody is fighting you going off and doing new things. Someone is fighting your new path. Could be someone you're disconnected from. Could be a past lover. It's Ten of Pentacles reversed all about. That's like the family card. Temperance upright. Devil upright. One more. happy, you're good, things are flowing well. Hearing, sensing, feeling. Somebody might feel like you're tangling up in something that you shouldn't be, that you don't have the clarity or good, good enough judgment. Queen of Swords to the King of Swords. This could be an older, wiser family member. Someone trying to talk sense into you. Knight of coins. Queen of coins. <laughs> Somebody saying slow down, slow down. Nine swords reversed to the ten of swords reversed. I'm hearing you're not ready, you're not ready, you're not ready. Why is the seven of swords here? <laughs> Magician reverse type priest. Okay, this isn't an older, wiser family member. The, the, someone definitely trying to talk sense into you when you're already being sensible. You can't trust this person. They're trying to manipulate you. They're trying. They're trying like hell to manipulate you. Because their ego is wounded. Knight of Wands, Queen of Wands. This is somebody that has been in and out of your life. They're pissed off because they can't come back and claim what's theirs. Because it's not theirs anymore. This is all happening because they want to try to, try to resurrect it. I'm not even going to clarify this. They want a new start with you. They want to mix cups with you. They want to resurrect this. But you're off to the new. What's this Ace of Wands about? What's this Ace of Wands about? I just dropped a bunch of cards. Emperor reversed, Hierophant reversed. They lose control if you go off on this new start. They miss an opportunity if you go off on this new start. They don't want you to go off on this new start. I feel like they kept you waiting for a minute. That's why you bounced. I feel like you already been down this road with this person once and you didn't get picked. Or they're pissed off because you didn't pick them. I see a walking away, of the, walking away from the dock. I see a no longer waiting. I see you going off and doing the new. Give me one on this three of wands. Seven of cups reversed to the eight of cups reversed. They're just going to keep coming back. Then it come back, try to cause confusion. I see you walking away. Hermit reverse, self-isolation.
Give me one on this Hermit Reversed. I feel like it's you. There we go. We have the sun into judgment. Making a final judgment call on what's going to make you happy. Isolating yourself from this person. The Hierophant and the Lovers. Going off and getting your divine union. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Give me a wisdom. Round and round. I feel like this is appropriate. 25, 25, 25. The appearance of this card is a reminder that although it may appear that you've gone backward, the truth is that you are standing at a higher level, looking down on your circumstances. Will you learn something, do something better, and break a cycle set up in the past? You actually have a bird's eye view of your initial footprints and can access the wisdom and lessons learned. Is it speaking to you? Libra Scorpio, is it speaking to you, honey? Is it speaking to you? All right. All right. I think I got one more in me. We're going to pause, clear the decks, and go to the next sign. All right, Scorpio Sag. You guys see that? Okay. Scorpio Sagittarius. Let's do it. Let's do it. One good shuffle. Okay. Eight of Cups reversed. Looks like someone may be returning to your life. See if it comes back out. Empress might have... Oh, sorry, that's strength. That is strength. Looked like the Empress at first blush. I didn't see the five, but that is strength. Could be a Leo. Could be someone, for a whole, uh, could be someone you held back from the past or someone that's holding back from you was holding back from you you could be returning to someone we'll see if it comes back out ten of pentacles reversed the fool reversed oh is it gonna be another one of them breakdown in the family lack of trust we'll see what comes out six of six of wands king of cups reversed strength came back out all right why? Knave of Wands, Four of Cups, the Star. Someone made an offer, you contemplated a cup, healing, outcome, Queen of Wands reversed, make a break, restless energy. Page of Pentacles reversed at the bottom of the deck. The withholding of a message, offer, or apology. Give me clarity. Page of Wands, Knight of Wands. Yeah. I feel like they're related. has something to do with a message, communication, or offer. Okay. Ah! Okay, I just dropped you. You're going back in. Give me one on this full reverse. Just one on the full reverse. Thank you. The Magician, the High Priestess. Things are manifesting. Things are coming together, but you're not sure. You're not sure. You don't quite trust it. Uh, maybe you don't feel like you have enough to offer. Maybe you don't feel like you're stable enough. Seven of Wands reversed to the Eight of Wands reversed. You're battling some inner demons. Possibly things are happening a little quickly. Give me one on the Six of Wands. Give me one on the Six of Wands. Six of Wands. 
three of coins reversed, four of coins reversed. Possibly something returning to your life, but there's a lack of stability. Something you had to let go in the past, maybe. Five of wands, six of wands is causing conflict. This is causing conflict. Could be internal, could be among you and the family. Strength in the Hermit. All right. Yeah, this is like inner demon shit. This is walking the path shit. King of Cups reversed. Whoa. Four of Wands, Five of Wands. King of Cups reversed. Trying not to show emotion. But you feel the connection, but there's conflict. You feel the connection, but there's conflict. You want to go for this, but you can't give it. You can't give it emotion. The Fool. Okay, Emperor reversed. Hierophant reversed, the fool and the magician. You're gonna miss an opportunity. You're gonna humble yourself and miss an opportunity. One on the fool. World reversed, four reversed. Yo! You're being told to go for it. You got unfinished business to settle. This is like something you have to deal with. I feel like somebody made an offer. And you contemplated it. Give me one on the strength. Give me one on strength. Two of swords, three of swords. Well, shiitake mushrooms. You're gonna hold back. You're gonna make a dis you're gonna make a heartbreaking choice. One on the star. Nine of cups reversed. Ten of cups reversed. You were healing. You weren't ready. You were healing, and you weren't ready. Oh, that's coins, not cups. Still, you were healing, you weren't ready. Possibly there was upheaval in the family. Possibly you didn't have enough to offer. There was healing, there was a rebuilding. One on the four of cups. Judgment in the world. You contemplated the ending. You contemplated an ending. You thought long and hard about this. I think you chose to end it because you weren't ready. Get, talk to me about the Knave of Wands. Ten of Swords to the Ace of Swords. You were not ready. It's being revisited because you were not ready. I think you still think you're not ready. You're going to end up kicking yourself in the ass for it later. Because you're going to reject an offer. One of the Queen of Wands reversed. Okay, give me two. Queen of Swords. Ace of Swords reversed. Queen of Swords. King of Swords. Ace of Swords reversed. Two of Swords reversed. You're going to end up kicking your ass. You're going to end up kicking yourself in the ass for this. That's how I feel. Don't. Because ultimately you're not ready. If you're willing to acknowledge the fact that you're not ready, then you're not ready. Don't kick yourself in the ass for it. An opportunity will come back around if it's meant for you. But you gotta come out of this state of restless energy. Give me one on this four swords reverse. 
four of coins reversed to the five of coins reversed. Yes. Yes. Once you release all that restless energy and that negative energy, doors that were closed will reopen. Three of wands to the four of wands, bottom of the deck. The door will reopen, but you have to wait out the process that you're going through right now. Give me a wisdom. Thank you. To be fair. To be fair. Number 38. 3 plus 8 is 11. Oh, 11, 11. Hmm. To be fair. Life offers experiences that are challenging and experiences that are nourishing. Yet over time, they strike a balance. Move your being from stasis to doing from discovering to loving to letting go to begin again. Life is a pendulum swinging between all these states. You will always oscillate back and forth between doing and being. If you are not content with where you are at this moment, remember that all experiences have their place. Accept without judgment, and you will see how the universe adjusts in perfect balance. You reap what you sow. For every cause, there is an effect. Wondrous things will be revealed now. Nice. That's not awful. All right, we're going to pause and go on to the next. All right, Sagittarius Capricorn. Let's keep it rolling. Five of Swords, Eight of Pentacles reversed. <laughs> Standing up, doing what's right. Possibly the avoidable argument. Challenges with holding your energy. Tower reversed. Two swords reversed. Hold that thought. There we go. Sorry, I saw it. I had to flip it back over. Ace of coins. All right. Why? King of Rods reversed, High Priestess, Seven of Wands. Okay. Outcome? Life isn't always fair. You don't always get what you want. world at the bottom of the deck. All things must come to an end so new things can begin. All right. Let's give me some clarity. Talk to me about the five of swords. Just one. Just one. King of swords, honest conversation time. You had to do what was best. Make a logical decision. I had to speak some truth. Possibly the challenge is someone is withholding from you. Give me one of the Ace of Pentacles. Justice reversed. Hangman reversed. Yeah, they, they... This feels so spiteful. They're still hung up on it because they may feel it wasn't fair. What's this tower reversed? 
five of swords, six of swords. One more. Eight of swords, nine of swords. That tells me they want to return, but they're a little afraid to. There's anxiety here. They want to rebuild, but they're holding back out of spite. Why the two of swords reversed? Again, place yourself where you see fit. If it's not you, it's the other person. Hey, what hey, what? Really? Old man, get off my table. What are you doing? Hmm. Ten of swords reversed. To the ace of swords reversed. Not having clarity to make a judgment. Something is not over. The delaying of a painful ending. Oh gosh. Okay. Come on. Judgment in the world. Trying to resurrect it even though it's over. Wanting to resurrect it even though that it's over. Fighting a painful ending. What's the Ace of Pentacles? Ace of Cups to the Two of Cups. Let me make you this small offer so that we can start over. I want stability with you. I don't want it to be over. It's all happening because of the King of Wands reversed. The High Priestess and the Seven of Wands. Okay, so... Not getting what they wanted? Somebody get what they wanted and... Ace of, swords, Ace of Wands to the Two of Wands. Somebody made a decision to go on a new path. And the other person did what they wanted. One on the High Priestess. The Moon and the Sun. Lack of clarity? Lack of clarity. But we were so happy. Things were going so well. Why can't you give me the answers that I want? Nine of Wands reversed, Ten of Wands reversed. And then the questions, why, why, why? Why are you throwing in the towel? Becomes a burden. Why the Seven of Wands? Somebody, somebody had some demons to battle. King of Wands, Page of Wands. Somebody's extremely combative. Like, I want what I want, and I want it now. And I'm not going to stop bothering you until I get what I want. Huh. Why the Emperor reversed is the outcome. Why the Emperor reversed is the outcome. Holy crap. Sag cap. Holy crap. Oh my goodness. Queen of Wands, King of Wands. Somebody is going to fight to try to recontrol this. Somebody is going to fight for what they want. Six of Swords, Seven of Swords. And no matter how bad you want to move on, they're just going to keep coming back. Put yourself wherever you see fit. Come back to reclaim what is theirs. Swords reversed to the eight of swords reversed. 
my goodness. My goodness. Wow, okay. Might lead to an honest conversation. This feels like the it's not you, it's me conversation. Why justice reversed is the make or break. Something is not balanced. Ten of wands to the ace of wands, just let it end. It's not balanced. You have to end the cycle. You have to release this burden. You have to cut this person loose. Six of coins reversed to the seven of coins reversed. I mean... If it's not balanced, no matter how much effort or energy you put into it, it's never going to be. You can work on this all day long. Do what you want. I feel like this person is kind of clingy and needy and overbearing and anxiety ridden and just isn't getting the point. That's how I feel. <sighs> Observer. Number 49. Most people see the world for a personal lens. They closely identify with their feelings and experiences, so much so that they come to believe that these are the only reality. There are times when you need to distance in order to gain perspective and understand your circumstances from a neutral vantage point. Now is one of those times in your life. This is a perfect moment for you to begin to do some exploring. Instead of only considering yourself, consider what you need to understand about the conditions, people, culture, and environment you're engaged with now. Be so happy you did. Illumination is a miracle you seek and will indeed find. I don't know who that was for, but it ties in. At least I see it tying in. Sometimes you just gotta take a step back and be like, whoa, what the F? All right, we're gonna pause and go on to the next.